shadows in Mexico. Please step up and call a number. Thank you, Olivia and Mario. Y hola, Florida. Okay, your question comes from Brooklyn. Hola. If you were the leader of your country, how would you have handled COVID with the COVID-19 pandemic? Okay, your question comes from Cheryl Atkins Green. I believe there's not a perfect way to handle this hard situation such as COVID-19. However, I believe that what I would have done was create the lockdown even before everything was that big. Because we lost so many lives and we cannot afford that. We have to take care of our people. That's why I would have taken care of them since the beginning. Thank you, Mexico. It's time for the final statement. Mexico, you're up first. Please make your selection. Changing beauty standards. So may we all tonight remember to normalize conversations about anxiety or depression. Vivimos en una sociedad que cada vez está más avanzada. We live in a society that more and more is more advanced. Y así como hemos avanzado como sociedad, también hemos avanzado en los estereotipos. And as we have advanced as a society, we've also advanced with stereotypes. Hoy en día, la belleza no radica solamente en cómo nos vemos. Para mí, la belleza radica en nuestro espíritu, en nuestra alma y los valores con los que nos manejamos. No permitan nunca que alguien les diga que no tienen valor. Never permit someone to tell you that you're not valuable. Thank you.
to our final two ladies. Please make your way to center stage. If for any reason the winner is unable to fulfill her duties, the first runner-up will take her place. Good luck to you both. The winner of the 69th Miss Universe competition is... Viva Mexico!